Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of A Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with... TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, I'm the man on the sticks. Fuck. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> and we're playing Control. Oh my god, Jonas, he, he ran up on me, I, dude. You just, I didn't even see this, woo. man. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> On fire. What the hell did I do to <laughs> de deserve all of this? <laughs> Caught myself off guard on that one. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Where are you? <laughs> How, can you switch? There's a many, switch? many, many men in there. Many men. Many, 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 many men. Miss death on me. I hate that you can't switch. Switch what? Like over her shoulder or something, dude. Because essentially, I can't take cover on the right side of anything because this oh, way I, got I have advantage on this side. But I can't. I can't do it. On it's this always side. the view's always off to the right a little. Yeah, bit. and I mean honestly, by default, I would prefer it was on the side that it is on. But it also means that I cannot take cover on the right side of doorways right. and I hate that because I would be switching it in order oh, there's to a, there's a little thing in there dude, dude I'm activate. just like hey welcome to the jungle I don't even know what that is man alright I'm really confused I'm, in, I'm intimidated right now the music's going yeah we don't really know what's going on in this game I see this door though sector this? elevator okay well, let's take this <laughs> At least there's nothing dangerous up here. Just a red door. Ah, oh, dude, no more locked doors. Red doors can't hurt you though. Yep. Boom. Open. Open sesame. All right. Just checking around. Red rooms usually. <gasps> oh, it's the quick way back, Aww, broski. Oh, okay. It's yeah. So you can actually get out. Okay. okay. All right. Fair. I love when games bring you back full circle. Yeah, that's cool. All right. <clears throat> Resident Evil does that a lot. All right, all right, like, oh, this door finally unlocks the door that's the shortcut. I guess we'll just ease on down the road here to the... It makes it sound like there's still men in here. I know, dude. I don't see anybody, but I know I didn't kill everybody either, so I'm a little confused. Perhaps I despawn them. What the hell is this? Am, is this what I'm supposed to do? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, you, do you have to activate the thing? I oh, know it won't let you. Yeah, it won't. It doesn't give me the option. It is a thing, though. Where did these guys go? Here, I'm going to leave. And then we're going <laughs> to let it save. Yeah, right. <laughs> and then we're going to go back in. All right. All right, we're back. There, uh, there we go. go. He was just stuck in the ceiling or something. <gasps> Oh my sweet god, dude! This is what I'm talking about right here. Yeah, he was, he was all up in your grill, dude. So yeah, like it just the game just like hiccuped or something, then, huh? Yeah, it does that. I guess. All right, are we done now? Are we done? Can I get my health back, please? Oh, I guess not. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, cool. Health required. And now I can act them evade. Yeah, yep. Okay, so they were just hiding in the ceiling. <laughs> yeah, this is that room that I passed by a bunch of times. Because I passed by, like, up in that area. Oh, yeah, they put all the blocks back, dude. <clears throat> yeah, and the dark obelisk with the red glowing insignia on it is, has been changed into, like, a regular looking ob obelisk. Yeah, dude, just a computer. There you go. You just gotta flip the. Got a creepy man projected on it. It's gotta flip the switch, dude. Badoop boop. Manual override. Just put your gun in it. <laughs> it's really weird, dude. Yeah, you can tell this this game was made by a man. How is your gun the key? Oh, there it opens up that door that we couldn't get into before. But see, the gun and the idea in this game is that normal everyday items can be like these beings of like immense power okay so like 
that gun is really like an entity. It's like it has it's, sen- it. it's sentient. The sector should be open it's now. sentient. It it has like extreme power. Like the fact that it can just turn into I'm a shotgun now, and it just kind of the way it moves and stuff. Yeah, and it has infinite ammo and whatnot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel you. Okay. And uh, like that disc that we encountered that gave me abilities, and like uh, the telephone that's just like chilling in a room because that telephone is real. Is apparently is like really powerful, dude, because it's a telephone of <laughs> Zeus's dude, telephone. Dude, most powerful telephone ever. We got to talk to Emily. Where's she at, dude? So, yeah. So we did this. Oh yeah, dude. All right, I'm going to go talk to this guy real quick just to see if he has anything to say to me since we helped fix you latest He'll be problem. Like, Congrats, buddy. You did it. He's going to be like, thanks, friendo. Yeah, are you my pal now because we got friend stuff happening? Where's guys? he at? Guys? Guys? No guys? All right, cool. Uh, He is this way, sir. This way. This is the right way. So we went that way, boom, we went that way. There's freaking Oh, Janny boy. Yeah, dude. I'm gonna make it on wait, one try. One try, Jonas. One try. One try. You only get one shot. Do not miss yeah, a chance dude, to blow. Spaghetti, dude. Yeah, dude. He's swiping up the spaghetti. <laughs> He's very sweaty. There was a thing on the wall you didn't collect yet. Where, dude? There's a dartboard? Yep, oh. What is this? What a mess. Burn the trash. Oh, it's a new mission. Yeah, boy. Thanks. Thanks. Into fire. Burn it all. Oh. Burn it into a reindeer, not into a moose. You have to go to the furnace room and just throw the stuff yeah. in there? Yeah. wonder if that's exactly what it is. Maybe that's what, because I did throw something in there, and then it, like, transformed, transformed the room a little bit. Oh, even this area is not red anymore. So I'm thinking that maybe if I were to uh, go in there and throw some, well, <clears throat> yeah, there might be some stuff in. What does the actual mission say to do? I guess it's probably just like throwing stuff in. The, I just didn't want to check because it, it pauses. Takes the game. forever to look in the damn menu. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, it it's most likely it's just uh, throwing stuff in a furnace and then fighting like increasingly hard waves of enemies. Yeah. Because, like, those first enemies were new, and then there's going to be like, oh, now you throw something else in there, there's more enemies. Oh, dude, now it's. Throw something else in there. Now it's a giant elephant tiger panda coming to get you. Oh, Joe, look at this place. I brought the lights back on, bro. Oh, dude. Are you kidding me? It's all all happy now. Yes, Steve. F. Is the clock back? Now. What do you mean? It feels a lot safer when you're around. Oh, okay. I guess I helped you out. I should be going. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. dude. All right. You got a lockdown to lift. Yeah, I thought he, you. He just told you you have a lockdown to lift. The lockdown is lifted. Yeah, dude, it's done. Oh, maybe after you talk to Emily, he'll he'll maybe. have something different to say. All right, so that I did not. That was through the control pump area, right? Oh, <clears throat> uh, wait. To get to what? To get to the furnace. Oh, do you want me to go do the furnace oh, mission? Oh, did you look at the mission and see what it said? No, he brought, I he didn't. brought it up I and then did he... I, I never did, actually. <laughs> I never brought it up. Where, which one is uh, it? Down, down. Uh, burn Zoom trash piled X. up around the furnace in the maintenance sector. So, yeah, literally that is what you have to do. Pick up the stuff and throw it in the furnace. Yeah. That's but. pretty easy. And we may not have to come back to this area. I think it was through the... Uh... <laughs> All right, Jonas, I guess I'll go do the mission then. <laughs> I mean, I don't care what we do. No, we'll go do it. it. We'll go do out. it because you sh- you seem to be showing interest in it, and I want you to be engaged. So let's uh, dude, go. I'm bur- always engaged. So let's go burn trash. It was through. It was not through maintenance. I believe it was through this area. Oh, fudge, Jonas. Yeah, dude, we can go talk to Emily. Okay. <laughs> I'm good with finding Emily instead. All right. No, dude. I want to do the mission you want to do. I just don't I want mean, to. F- it's just throwing trash into the fire, dude. Uh, I know, but was there, a, was there a point next to it? I wonder. I feel like there might have been there a point. There might have been. Yeah, dude. That's a good. Uh... We can check out some control points because that doesn't take a thousand millennia. All right. So these are all in this are area. The pump's entrance. The pump's entrance? 
Which one is that? One? Yeah, because it says furnished chamber. It's right there. That's right. it. This one here? Yeah, because right next to where it's blinking, it says furnished chamber. All right, we'll go there. Yeah, it must be close. <clears throat> we'll go there. Would you swim in a pool that looked like that? Would I swim in a pool that looked like that? I have an issue with swimming in pools all, like all together, let alone swimming in a pool that looks like crystal scales or like conch shells or. Yeah, dude. Have you ever listened to a conch shell? Have you ever heard anything? Uh, I never understood why people said you could hear the ocean. All I hear is nothing. All right, furnace. Like the sound of my soul. Like <laughs> the sounds of your soul. All right, let's. Well, there's just nothing happening. <laughs> a bunch, of, bunch of nothing. Just a bunch of absolute <laughs> nothing. All right, so let's just see what happens if I throw that into the fire. Oh, you, wait, you might want to activate the other mission. Uh, do I need it activated? I wonder what other trash there is. I can activate it real quick, I guess. Yeah, that's it. Trek. Okay. We're here. I'm throwing stuff in your fire. Oh my god, dude. This is ominous as hell. What are those? Are those guys? Uh, I don't think so, no. I thought I saw I wonder, something. Is there me. stuff like right by the fire? Was that where you picked up the thing before? Was like, was this stuff like literally like in front? Oh wait, that thing has a marking on it. Is that what you need to throw on the fire? Did Atim barrels full of hazardous biological <laughs> material? <laughs> yes. Mm. I take it that's the trash you need to throw on the fire, but... Yeah, I'm assuming so That's as well. interesting. Oh, it's radioactive trash, bro. Oh. Oh! Oh, dude, that makes the fire go out, dude. It's like they're breaking some environmental regulations. Oh, you're almost... Okay. Yeah, dude, you got a few of them to do. It's giving you a little progressive. Progresses. Sweet. All right. I get it, dude. I get it. All what? right. There. Oh, is that one? No, that is not one, but... My name is Dr. Pierce. Well, that's a collectible, though. Of the Parakinesiology Department. I believe I discovered Omega... Yeah, you did, lady. You discovered it. Is this one? Nope. This is not one, but you know what? You know what? I'm, I'm feeling generous. There you go, fire friends. Go ahead and take one of those, too. Oh, not... there's one. Hey, look, I found one. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's always where you don't want to find it. <laughs> yeah, man. Secretly, I I was gonna go down there anyway, right? Probably not. All right, so I got a bunch of them done. There's still a bunch more. Yeah, you're about halfway. It looks like. I think there's one in the corner. Nope, that's just a regular barrel. Yeah, there's got to be some down there. Even oh, no, there's one, one right here. Getting a little blowy from across the pond. I think I can. Pr I'm gonna try to. Like I'm trying to angle it. All the way. I'm gonna angle this bad boy. We're gonna go ahead and see. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, there's one. Nope. 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 Don't do that. Don't do. Can I, can I break that? <laughs> can I just break that really? No, that's a real one. They tricked you. That one. No, that's not one. Nope, that's not one. All right, we're going back now. Why are they playing games with your heart, dude? I don't know, dude. It's kind of bothersome, to be honest. All right. Uh, uh, we got to find these barrels, yeah, dude. dude. This is, like, you sent us on the wild goose chase. You want yeah, to do dude. the barrel hunt now? I want a barrel hunt, dude. Nah. A barrel boy. <laughs> nah, I want a barrel hunt now, dude. Yeah, dude. Son of a barrel boy. All right. Got to get the barrels. All right. That's, there's no more barrels down here. Man, yeah, Jones, you should sing me a barrel hunting song. Uh, who's going barrel hunting? We I'm going, going barrel, barrel hunting. hunting. Cut a mother barrel licking fun. Barrel. Be, 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 I'm not be, licking be, be, a barrel. Be, cut a barrel. <clears throat> yeah, I'm dude. Not, not licking a barrel. You ever seen anybody go over the falls in a barrel? Um, not in person. All right. So look, there's no barrels up here. Not in person. You saw it like on a video or something. Uh oh, there's oh. one right in front of us somehow. And the other one I think is in the is in the wall over there behind you. Like if you turn around. Yeah, right there. 
Oh, and then that probably opens up that door over there. That's all of them. Because there is a door. How do you get in that? What did, what did you get for doing that mission? Uh, I don't know. Huh. <clears throat> I feel like I can make it into that. Let's see if I can utilize this railing first. To some extent, I can. Ooh, it's very... You can't really... Okay. Can't really <clears throat> do much on it. <laughs> do, I, would spend, I would spend 35 minutes just sitting here trying to make it into that area. Enemies? Well, I mean, that'd be an entertaining video. Enemies? Well, I'm not going to, but I, I mean, I would. Oh, I know. Yeah, yeah. yeah oh, sure. oh, oh, oh. This this might be it right here. All right. Oh. Ah! One more try, one more try, one more try. Yeah, that seems similar. To what, oh. All right. Never mind. We're done. Jeez. I can't give up. Right after I try it one more time. No, I'm not going to. We're out of here. We gotta go talk to Emily. All right, that's yeah, easy we'll to find. We'll go see what she's doing. She's just hanging out, dude. You need these fast travel points, man. This, oh this yeah, issue dude. Is it absolutely helps tremendously. Nuts. Where's where's she at? Emily is. She's in the executive, central executive, oh, there you I go. believe. Oh, easy peasy, dude. And fast travel, they were. <clears throat> Oh, that's the lady who's like, you're the new director? Oh, here's a gun. Yeah. I don't know who you are, but do you want a firearm? <laughs> I mean, that's kind of what happened. <laughs> you just find a guy and take the gun off of him. And yeah. the gun turns into a creature. That yeah. Oh, no, yeah. She's like, oh, yeah, you know this gun that killed that the guy killed himself with? That's your gun now. Yeah, you keep that gun. You know he's dead? Oh, yeah, that's cool. You're the director now. Oh, I mean, gentlemen, if we're looking for, like, continuity, none of this makes any sense. Like, if this right. kind of stuff went on in real life, I'd just I'd be in the corner crying. <laughs> yeah. I'm a big I'd fan. I'd probably be pretty sad, too. I'm a big fan of crying in the corner when... Some eldritch horrors take over the world. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm not a big fan of eldritch horrors. I'm not going to survive during a zombie apocalypse. So if that pops off, just, you know, I'll bite myself, I guess. Uh, but... <laughs> bite myself, I guess. <laughs> right. I mean, that's one way to do it, right? Hey, let's get it out of the way. Let me in. Emmy, baby, bubby. And you lifted the internal lockdown. Yeah, I did. Let's talk, Emily. All right. Yes, of course. Yes. I did everything you Listen, asked, baby. Emily. Screw it. Just tell her. I love you. I haven't been huh. completely honest. I have a younger brother. Uh, she looks like Zuckerberg. Dylan. When we were kids, we found an old slide projector in Ordinary's landfill. The slides created doorways. To other places. Bad things happened. Came through. That's all she gets. The rest stays locked inside. Oh. We, we ended help. the world. Through one of the doorways, we met something. A being. What? A being. What kind of being? I want to meet a being. It's hard to describe, but it. She helped us. We oh. managed to turn the projector off. The bad things that came through the doorways were gone. After that, your people came, tried to grab us. I ran away. They got Dylan. I left him behind. Bureau agents took your brother? Yes. He covered it up. No one believed me. Oh, that's the truth. <laughs> I just want to find Dylan. I've been looking for him ever since. What happened to the slide projector? It sounds like another object of power. I thought you took it. The Bureau. Along with Dylan. I've never heard of huh. it, but around here, I assume everything's classified. You know, I looked into the ordinary AWE case files after you mentioned it. Trench and Darling were both involved. 
a large area of the containment sector was reserved for it. The case hasn't been active for a long time. I have no idea if anything's still there. Can you tell me more about this being you found? Let's hope you two get along. She's been with me ever since ordinary. In my head. She led me to you. How do you use the bathroom? I the call her. What? Stars. As in a guiding star. Did Polaris know about the hiss? If she got you in here in spite of the lockdown, she's very powerful. This lady's weird. Which may <laughs> help explain your test results. Your readings are incredible, Jesse. Now, cross-referencing them with the database, I found two matches in Darling's old classified files. Unfortunately, I can't access them beyond the file codes. But one was P6, referring to a prime candidate for a potential future bureau director. Uh, this was logged years ago. Dylan. Is that Dylan? No, it's The other brother. match is on something mm. called Hedron, which must be connected to these Hedron resonance amplifiers somehow. All I know is that Marshall went to the research sector to secure the HRA production after the his first attacked. So, Marshall seems like our best lead on Dylan. I need to go after her. How can I get to the research sector? Use my key card. The sector elevator will take you there. Boom. Yeah, level three, baby. Yeah, <laughs> baby. The next I like step. it like that. What was Emily told me about ordinary, my powers being connected to things in the Bureau's past. I am so close to something. The swimming pool. Do you pool. feel it? Dun, dun, dun. Something's keep, coming. Yeah, they keep showing that swimming pool. We take turns to come for a visit. I helped you. You owe me now. Uh, and oh. when time comes, I will come calling. <laughs> He's like, I told you where to go. Now you owe me your soul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Overridden. Boom, dude. Yeah, yeah like the a, dance. The of, old boys club. The old boys club. Fine Marshall research pap parapsychology. All right. There was an area over here somewhere where there was like yeah, over here. Where there was a level three door I couldn't get into, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, dude, what's in there? Some freaking sweet stuff. What does that even say? Internal lockdown effect, building lockdown effect. Jute box at AI secure. <laughs> Head of research override. There's right. some cigarettes in there. I can't There's something it. on the counter you can oh, pick up. Oh, yeah, give me that, dude. America's overnight results. Okay, well, let's check that out for a minute. No. Uh, redacted. Oh, yeah, sweet. That's cool. Good thing. All right, and then give me the box. That's mm, what daddy wants. There would be wants. something good in there, dude. If it's like a level three door, dude. Mm. Three doors down. So just a... That's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I need it anyway. It's fine. Uh, And then... I still can't, can't get in here, though. Mm. Yep. But this is the jukebox. Like, that jukebox, that's a dangerous jukebox. You ever use a jukebox like that? Uh, I mean, I have, but even the jukebox I used that was like that, it just played CDs. Never one that, like, played records. Um, anymore. there was a Pizza Hut in Ashtabula that had a jukebox. Didn't look like that, but it was one that actually played records. Yeah? Yeah, like back in the day. And then they got rid of that. And then my, uh, my dad dated a lady after my parents got divorced, and she owned a bar, and she had an actual record, like a 45 jukebox. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, and you would hit, like, C1, and it would, like, yeah. That's the first place <laughs> I ever heard Clarence Carter stroking. <laughs> she had a 45 of Clarence Carter stroking That's in the, in the I jukebox. where I first heard Clarence Carter stroking. I be stroking. <laughs> <laughs> Stroke it to the east. All right, so where do what do I have to do next? Is that yeah? It's this right? Old oh, there's boys. a is this a time thing? Because why does it say eighteen oh four? I don't know. It says maintenance major targets go to NSC energy converter and it says eighteen oh four. All right, but uh, it says that Paul Jesse and me know about Dylan. Okay, so I just have to go there. So I'm, it's tracked. 
And where is it, though? <laughs> Nowhere. It's not an executive. The hotline chamber. Where do you see that? <laughs> Why is that what you point out? It's then? the big circle on the bottom, dude. Yeah, but that's not where I'm supposed to go. I know. It just reminded me of Drake. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, does it show me up. where my mission I'll is? Lift you. Is it down here? No, no, no. I don't know how to get there. I guess I'll, I'll figure it out, dude. But e either way, that's it for this one, man. We'll All right. Well, uh, we'll find Marshall on the next one because that is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, have you already done that? Uh, it does Twitch stuff. TNT Dynamite on Twitch every single day at 10 o'clock a.m. Central. That's TNT D-I-N-O-M-I-G-H-T underscore crazy sound on Twitch.tv. Uh, for Jonas. Uh, catch you on the next one. We are oh. out.